Ladies and gentlemen, I will heal this planet. Even if I have to kill someone to do it. That's probably not likely though. I'm fairly confident I'm here alone, which actually just makes me sad now that I think about it. But as you can see, my terraformation is going up at quite a nice rate. However, it could be much, much faster. I have this big old crafting station and through it, I learned I can make this jetpack. I just need a ton of iridium to then make a rocket engine to then make the jetpack. The news is I happen to have a ton of iridium right in here. Thank you. Mm, give me. And then one super alloy along with the second rocket engine means if I craft you, I can then then grab my jetpack. How lovely. All right, and I'm assuming I can just kind of fly around, right? Is this? Oh yeah, this is nice. Is there a cap on this anywhere? Hello? Can I just fly around forever? Wow, this is uh, extremely handy. Huh, <laughs> just a whole new world. I feel like I'm playing Minecraft creative. Of course, I can also get more upgrades if I just get more super alloy, which, hang on. I just have a ton of this in here, actually. Wait, oxygen tank tier four? Yep, that was easy enough. And I believe I just need one of you, because this makes backpack tier four. Wow. Wow, that was a lot of upgrades very quickly, huh? I also got this questionably shaped trophy, but I'll put it down right there. Now the big thing I want to build, this nuclear reactor. But I need a uranium rod. I also have this tier 3 heater, I didn't even think about this. Tell you what, let's go get a bunch of iridium. My oxygen is 370, I think I'm okay for a little bit. Hello, you little iridium cave, you. Mm, gimme please. God, there's just so much down here, oh my gosh. Isn't there aluminum in here? Yes, there is. I've pretty much gotten to the point where I need all the rare materials, common materials, don't really interest me anymore. Ooh, there's another chest here too. Thank you. And then dismantle it, please. Thank you. Now, is there like a uranium cave anywhere? If there's an iridium one, I feel like there has to be a uranium one, right? I guess that could also just be wishful thinking, but hey. Honey, I'm home with a ton of iridium and aluminum. Hey, it all fits. All right, one iridium rod, please. Can I make another one? Wow, two iridium rods, please. I think I just need two titanium, wherever this might be. Good thing I can fly. Thank you, and thank you. So now I should be able to make one tier three heater and yet another. Please tell me I can fit this in here. Gosh dang it, all right. Hang out awkwardly by the food grower, I guess. Low power? Oh, those heaters are taking 35, huh? That's fine, that's what we have solar panels for. Now I am a tad bit curious about something. Thing. I was in the iridium cave and it jumped out at me. Can I just use my jetpack to kind of squeeze on up, please? Yep, Denied. thank you. Oh no, I'm falling. I didn't think I was gonna have to perform an exploit to try and get up here. That's fine. Exploiting's like my number one easiest thing to do. Perfect. I uh, really don't think I was supposed to be up here. I <laughs> guess I'm clipping through a bunch of walls. I just thought there might be something cool in the mountain. I've now, however, trapped Psych. myself in here and I don't know how to get out. Is this part of the play area? <laughs> nope, this is just a hole in the ground. Okay, but oh, launch platform. What? That's not like it'll be handy if I could only get out of here. I think I have to wait till I die. <laughs> Much like Icarus, I went a little too close to the sun, or in this case, some scary looking mountain. Oh, and I have clouds now too. This whole terraformation thing is going excellent so far then. Good news, I just got a grass spreader because my terraformation index has to be flying. And even more good news, I died. Oh man, pretty soon I'm gonna have rain. Oh wait, I feel like I remember you guys telling me that I need to get off the ground because eventually lakes will form. Maybe I should learn to take that advice. For I now though, with my newfound jetpack, I might as well go exploring. Already found a chest. Things are going good. On the topic of exploring, there's something I need over here. Ooh, I got a biodome too. Looks like I'm about to get two things for one because now that I have the jetpack, I was told I could. There it is. Hi, golden crate. Anything cool? Iridium rod? Some stuff I already have? You could have been a bit cooler, but I'll accept you anyways. Deconstruct. Aluminum and another super alloy. Looks like my terraformation index is also climbing at just such a steady rate now. Ooh, I'll probably be able to hit a million, huh? Honey, I'm home again. Time to drop off all the goodies. And so I'm getting a bunch of new unlocks, all for stuff that seems like it's about to be pretty useful. I feel like I've got a pretty solid base here, but if it's gonna flood, I'm pretty much screwed. So I think that's where foundation grids can come in handy, right? Can I just do something where I connect it like this? And I just unlocked an ore extractor. Hang on, that sounds like it's gonna be really handy. Is four tall enough? Is this good? It'll work for now. How do I make that ore extractor though? Oh, I need a lot. What is osmium? 
uranium. Why is there always gotta be something new? Also, do I have enough uranium for a rod? No, I need three more, dang it. One of these days. Something like just making a little foundation grid and then the living compartment on top. There we go, new base formation underway. Right now though, I need to make some water bottles. Good thing I have just a ton of ice in here. Water, water, just keep, yep, you got it. Good work, thank you, crafting away. Give me magnesium, the seed lerma, and some aluminum. Cause now I can make a grass spreader. Uh, not really sure what this would be for, but I'll place one in the middle of everything and I'm low power again. That's fine, I'll place another one down right outside. I need uranium for this reactor. Oh, silicon, where are you? I feel like I always end up needing you too. There you are, come here. Is this another one right here? Perfect. But right now, I'll just have to make some more solar panels. And look at this thing go, wow. Looks like I'm a quarter of the way to rain too. I feel like that'll help with all the flowers and stuff. But if I need uranium for a rod, there's really only one thing I can think of to do now. And that's to go loot some ships. I know I've already looted everything in there, but there's still this monstrosity I've left untouched for now. Untouched solely because I died last time. <laughs> But still, I've got a jetpack, increased oxygen amount, a huge backpack, not afraid. There's also a ton of ores over here. <laughs> Maybe I need to do a little farming over here too. All right, hello again, spaceship. What did I leave in here? Cause I didn't have enough room, huh? I'm assuming a lot of stuff. Well, I at least left a seed. Why is this place always so scary? Ooh, blueprint. And a free rocket engine? Don't mind if I do. Anything upstairs, maybe? Just another little room? Nothing for you. How about you, big crate? Inventory full, that's not what I wanted to do. There we go. Oh, just some Lerma and food. Munch. I didn't, oh my gosh, there was like a whole secret wall here. Oh, there's so much. Anything really cool? No, I wanted uranium. Gosh dang it, that's fine. Plenty of time to take some trips back. Is it starting to rain? Oh, fairly confident I don't have that unlocked yet, but that's fine. I'll take a little drizzle here and there. All right, give me all the cool stuff. Stuff. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yep. Lovely. And some more. Oh, sweet, sweet rain. This is also the last trip I needed to get all of this stuff. At least on the right side. There's still a whole left area. And another ladder. Oh boy, what am I in for? Uranium. That's what I'm in for. Yes. And another free rocket engine. Wow. Just so much stuff in here. Oh, for me too. I really don't know who died on here, but man, am I glad they did. Oh, three large storage crates later and we're done. <laughs> At least with the big ship, I still need to explore all the wreckage. You never know what's gonna be hidden around. Maybe that freaking osmium that I need is around here somewhere. Or just another random chest. This works too. Ooh, and the dunes of this planet just stretch out so far. Have we ever heard of grass? Maybe. I guess it's kind of my job to actually put that here now, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it looks like there's a whole new area back here, too. Let's hang off on that for a second. Uh, is there a secret golden chest on this ship, too? I pretty much just scouted the entire perimeter and didn't see anything. No, I think we're actually good. All right, for my first trip back, since I have to make nine of them, give me my three blueprints and uranium. Don't go anywhere. I'll be back about five more times, I think. I just got such a good haul, though. What can you expect from me? Ooh, a flower pot got unlocked, too. It's all starting to come together. Oh, no way. Look, I have grass. Oh, look at this. Oh, it feels so good. I haven't felt grass in years. I should touch this more often. Really? Let's head over here and decode my blueprints. Looks like I got a GPS satellite, a mapping thing, a shredder, destroys objects, explosive powder? What is all this stuff? Wait a second, I know I saw a mapping chip in here somewhere. Am I not getting it because of a bug or something? Oh no, wait, it's a screen. Well, now that I know that, I can move on to different things, like snacking up on my uranium and finally making a uranium rod. Thank you. And there's the atmospheric water collector for all the rain, I'm assuming. Either way, I can finally make a nuclear reactor and get a ton of power. I wonder how fast my terraformation index is gonna increase when I place this down. Oh, wow, I feel like that's going about 1.8 times faster. How much energy do I have to spare? A hundred? <laughs> Oh, nuclear reactors are fun. All right, time to run all the way back yet again. Oh, I feel like I'm about eight minutes away from drawing a face on like a volleyball and just calling it Wilson. I am, I am just so alone over here. All right, next chest. And all of you, please. I feel like this process is gonna take me a second and I will for sure be needing more locker storage. Oh, wait, I guess I passed rain. Now I'm onto liquid water. Oh, that's probably where the lakes and stuff come in, huh? Maybe I need to hurry it up. Yoink. Oh, and my terraformation index has finally hit a million. What a good day. This planet might have some hope after all. Oh, would you look at that? It's finally raining again. I don't know in what intervals that happens. I'm just happy to see it. Now there's something that I greatly, greatly, greatly wanna create. This is 
make sure I move it away from my base for a little bit. Because it's a gigantic launch platform. Can I smack? Yeah, this is neat. I don't know. What do I do up here? Oh, I can like pick and choose what rockets to send. This GPS satellite also sounds extremely handy if I want to figure out where I'm at. Attracts uranium asteroids? And this one attracts iridium? Well, uranium's the one I want. Hang on. If I get enough uranium, I have infinite energy. Remember, friends, nuclear energy is green energy. I might have already forgotten everything I needed to craft it, though. Did I get enough? Yes, I did. All right, go get him, buddy. Can I... Do I get to hit a button? I do. Ready! Aim! Fire! Go! My beautiful rocket! You... My gosh, this is so gigantic. How is that that little material? All right, bring me some uranium, please. Go get him, tiger champ. Wow, he's really just going. Is my... I'm sorry, is the sky changing color? Is that good or bad? Oh, I think it's because it's time for a meteor shower, huh? All right, that means it's time to start resource harvesting. <laughs> Thank you, free uranium. This is... Oh, it's one of my better ideas, I think. I've got the iridium cave for just free iridium. I've got the uranium asteroids for infinite uranium asteroids. I've got my winning smile for everything else. It was very short-lived, but that is fine by me because I can already make another uranium rod. Oh, but I'm out of super alloy. Ah, that's fine. I've got rockets now. Pretty much nothing's off the table to me anymore. The real question now is, where do I get osmium for this ore extractor? 